Making new slides from templates. Wouldn't it be nice if you could select a certain look that includes a background color and font size for all your slides without you having to choose those things for each slide you make? Well, you can. LibreOffice Impress makes it easy with something called a template. A template is like a rubber stamp with a certain look set up for you. Each time you create a new slide, it stamps it for you. Then all you have to do is add content to the slide. I have saved a blank impress presentation called Practice Project RL, whereas RL are my initials. You'll find the templates under the Master Pages section of the task pane. Master Pages puts them into three categories for you. The template or templates used in your current presentation, the recently used templates, and all the other templates available for use. To select a template to be used for your presentation, simply click once with the left mouse button. I chose this blue one here, the Metropolis template. Notice that after I click on it, it now appears in the used in this presentation category. Any new slide that I create now will have a Metropolis theme applied to it. Creating a new blank slide is easy. Simply click on the New Slide button at the top to create one like this. But unless you choose a slide layout, all your slides will have a title at the top and a big content area under it. There are ways, however, that you can change that. One way is to choose a layout when you create a new blank slide. Instead of clicking directly on the New Slide button, Click on the little arrow to the right of it. Let's choose the last one. The last one is called Title, 6 Content. This layout looks interesting. You could put text, videos, audio, or pictures into each one of them, or any combination of those. This layout might be useful for making a photo album. You can also change the layout of a slide that you've already created. Suppose I want to change the second slide to the six content layout as well. Simply single click to select it, then expand the layout section under the task pane. Ah, there it is at the bottom right. Let's select it by single clicking on it. Presto, but if I've selected layouts for all of these slides, why then do they all look the same in the slide pane on the left? The answer is simple. The slide pane thumbnails only show content, not placeholders. These boxes on your slides are called content placeholders. That is, they are special laid out areas where you can put your own content such as pictures, text, or movies. Since content placeholders don't actually display when your slideshow is playing, they don't appear in the slide thumbnails on the side pane either. Now it's your turn.